you're probably being lied to. You've been on a fitness journey for some time now, and the two things that most people pay attention to when they first start out are actually lying to them. And let me explain to you. These are the two liars. Number one, the scale. The scale is one of the biggest liars because here's the deal. As you're building muscle, you're speeding up your metabolism, you're probably losing body fat, but you're not seeing much change at all. If anything, sometimes you'll see that scale go up. Unfortunately, that's part of the beginning of your journey, which is actually a good thing. What we need to focus on are these other four things that I'll get to in just a moment here. So stop focusing solely on the scale. The scale does not give you all the answers. It only gives you a fraction of the equation, a fraction of the viewpoint of what you're actually seeing. So don't just focus on the scale. It's not going to give you the full picture of what's actually going on. And it's not going to be able to tell you if you're doing all the right things or all the wrong things. The second thing that's lying to you is the mirror. Unfortunately, we see ourselves in the mirror naked every single day, whether it's getting out of the shower, walking by it, whatever it may be, when you see yourself in the mirror, we have a very skewed perspective of what we're actually seeing. When you look in the mirror, you're more likely to judge yourself, be harsh on what you see. Chances are, if you are seeing change, you won't actually see it. And that's simply because we have a skewed perception of what we see. So what I want you to do is instead of those two liars, I want you to focus on these four things. Number one, your progress pictures. Progress pictures give you a more complete view of what's going on. So if you look over a week, over a month, over three months, over six months, you compare them side by side, you'll have a better perspective of what's actually going on. So one of the best pieces of advice I got on my own journey when I first started out is every two weeks, compare your photos side by side. You'll be able to see a lot more change. If you do it every week, sometimes it's harder to see. Another piece of advice I got is have someone else look at them. Again, we have a really harsh perspective on what we see. Ask a friend, ask a family member, ask a coach to give you feedback back on what they're seeing in your progress photos. They'll have a better idea of what's actually happening and maybe even give you advice on what you can do instead. Number two, strength increase. One of the clearest signs you're moving in the right direction, giving your body the proper amount of nutrients is getting stronger. So if you're getting stronger in the gym, more than likely you're moving towards your goal of losing body fat and building muscle. Number three, clothes. If your clothes fit better, you're probably looking better, which in turn is gonna help you get to your goals. So clothes is something a lot of people don't pay too much attention to. If the waistband on your shorts is getting a little looser, if your shirt sleeves are getting a little tighter, if the glutes are getting tighter in your pants, you're probably building muscle. You're probably probably moving in the right direction. And it's again, hard to see when you're not paying attention to it side by side. If you're just looking in the mirror every day, expecting to see your clothes fitting differently, you might have a skewed perspective. And last but not least, compliments. A lot of the times we underestimate or we think people are lying to us when they give us compliments and say, hey Tyler, you're looking amazing. Or hey Nancy, you are seeing great results. What are you doing? And you might brush them off saying, no, 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 like I don't see it. No, take the compliments, say thank you. I appreciate you. What do you notice? Ask people. People, what they see changing. People that don't see you every day, they'll typically see a lot more change than you will because you're not paying attention to these things. You're paying attention to these liars. I hope you got some value out of today's video. And if you have questions, comments, anything for me, please shoot me a message on Instagram or comment below this video and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.